Assembly Member O'Connell has uh, indicated he wants to come in on this question. Yes, if I'm, if I may, Chair, thank you very sure. much. It's, it's, my, it's my constituency. I was, I was there, post-event, massive tragedy for people of Croydon, and I thank all those uh, people who supported all those organisations and people who supported that time and continue to support. And yes, it's regrettable that the inquest, which was supposed to be held only a couple of weeks ago, has been put off to the new year. Um, and I, I join in more in sort of sadness and in anger in supporting a request for some work, work to be done independently on this, not least to close down these, these outstanding concerns. Uh, and I think that is important. Um, and this is obviously not politics at play from, 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 from me. Um, it may well be that the inquest itself and the terms of reference could include somehow some of these outstanding issues um, uh, in their deliberations. But I do support and suggest that whilst there are outstanding questions that will hover and that won't go away, they need addressing properly, not least, and probably most importantly, to put the minds at rest of those people who are most directly affected. So I, I support <coughs> this suggestion. I know it's difficult for everybody, but let's Let's try to seek justice and peace for those people who've been affected, Mr Chair. Thank you. Well, Chair